Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. A brand new Spotlight Terror event has just been announced for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. I'm gonna cover all of the details in today's video. So as of midnight on the 14th of May, the Walking Wake and Iron Leaf Spotlight Terror event that's been running for the last two weeks in game has come to an end. So you, if you haven't got that Pokemon already, unfortunately you're gonna have to wait until another event comes around or potentially into the DLCs before you get these new exclusive Paradox Pokemon. But on that note, with that event, ending we've just had the announcement of our next spotlight terror event which will be happening later this week and hot off the press if we hop over to Cerebi we can see that it is going to feature two more paradox pokemon in great tusk and iron treads really nice to see these paradox pokemon coming to the games these will be five star terror raids as always with the spotlight terror raid event and they will be running alongside the return the second phase of that seven star chestnut event that will be running again in conjunction with it over the weekend of May the 19th through to the 21st like it says alongside that chestnut raid there isn't much more information that we've got right now on this terror raid event so it just looks like it will be featuring these two pokemon as of yet if there's any more updates of course we'll cover those as and when that news does come the event will feature a focus on gray tusk in pokemon scarlet and iron treads in pokemon violet and it will commence as usual at midnight utc on may the 19th through to midnight on the 21st of may so over that entire weekend and it's going to give players a chance to get these paradox pokemon without having to go into area zero where you would normally get them which is pretty exciting and you're also going to have the opportunity to get them with a variety of different terror types which is super exciting and i feel like this kind of starts to pave the way for what future spotlight terror events we'll be seeing in these games as we go forward if they do all of the exclusive paradox pokemon going forward that would lead us probably right up to when the dlcs will be launching because you've got a bunch of them that are exclusive obviously to Scarlet and then to Violet. So there's a bunch of them to go through that are gonna run alongside these seven star terror raids that we currently have going on. Of course, we've already mentioned that the Chestnut will be running this weekend as well. So that'll be its second phase. And on the Sunday evening of this week, we should get the announcement of our next seven star terror raid. Whether that's Del Fox, which has been talked about quite a bit and what I think it will be, or whether it's Rillaboom, one of those others, or something completely different what we don't expect. But I'd love to hear your thoughts on what you think of this new spotlight terror raid event for these paradox pokemon and also what you think the next seven star terror raid will be in these games when we get the announcement after the second phase of that seven star chestnut so very quick update today friends but thank you so much for tuning in we will do a best build if you would like to see this later in the week for these five star pokemon obviously the great tusks is a fighting and a ground type so they're the stabs that it will carry and then the iron treads is a steel and ground type so they're the sort of attacks that you will basically see coming off them uh, but again they're only going to be five star raids so i wouldn't have thought too difficult but there are going to be pokemon that are going to be specifically built to get through these raids pretty quickly farm them for the good item drops that they normally give with them so it'll be interesting to see what item drops we get from these raids as well but we'll leave it there and we'll update if anything else comes out later in the week hopefully we get some news about pokemon home as well that is something on the cards that everyone's kind of expecting maybe to drop later this week so fingers crossed we do get something and of course if anything does come out we'll cover it straight away here on the channel so thank you so much for taking the time to watch today's video have a great rest of your day and i'll see you all in another video very soon so until then friends take care of yourselves and bye bye